Hi, this is going to be a what I ate in a day video and I started the day with about a cup of uh, cut up cantaloupe and also with a cup of coffee. I was up late the night before so I took a little nap but when I got up around 11 this was the breakfast I had. It's a Jamaican breakfast with some sauteed greens, banana, uh, dumpling, yam. Okay so this is some of the breakfast that's left with well, what my mother made this morning so you've got green banana that's roasted in here uh, you have dumpling which is made from flour and water uh, yam and what else was there there was potato or something I mean the breakfast is often full of starch and a traditional Jamaican is not overweight so this really just lends credence to Dr. McDougall and this article that I just read and other stories about blue zones where people eat up to 85% starches, plant whole plant starches, and they're lean, trim, and healthy. And also with this breakfast is, this is the rest of the spinach. I guess I'll eat this. I didn't eat all of it. Spinach, tomato, and my mom's great because she normally would make this with saltfish. Jamaicans love their saltfish, but she's just made it with veggies so that I can eat it. Starches really do fill you up. All right, guys, so I haven't had anything since uh, <laughs> my last meal. So I'm going to take the rest of this spinach, and I'm going to just, I, I just made these sausages. You're going to see the video. I'm going to just saw, cut this up and saute that with the spinach and eat this before eating my proper dinner. It's already 6 o'clock, but I like to eat dinner like 8 o'clock. All right, I've decided to have my sausage and spinach mix with also the dumpling. All right, guys, so I'm finally having my dinner, and it's like 8.45, so pretty late. But I'm still fairly full from my dumpling and the sausage spinach mix. My daughter wanted to have the Gardein, uh, what do you call it? Oh, the, the mandarin chicken. So I went and bought uh, a pack of that, since that's one of the ones you can still get. And I gave her some, I made some fried rice for her. She wanted the fried rice with the sausage pieces, so I put that. So I've got just like, I don't know, maybe three tablespoons of that here with two of the pieces of Gardein mandarin chicken. And I'm going to have salad. So I've got some uh, cucumbers, romaine lettuce, um, red and green peppers in here, and some, what do you call this, sautéed? Not really sautéed, uh, the pumpkin seeds. I put them in the pan and I roasted. There you go. That's the word. And I'll put probably a little bit of uh, vinegar on there, probably a little bit of olive oil, maybe just the vinegar, balsamic, and I'm going to eat that. That's my dinner. I'm going to have some water with that. I really don't feel too hungry, but I want to get some salad in me. All right, guys. I'll be back if I have something else. I think I'm going to make avocado mousse. I have an avocado that's getting brown, so I might have a little bit of that. And I did decide to make that avocado mousse, and I'm surprised. It was a, not too huge of an avocado, like maybe a good medium-sized one, and it has given me enough for me and my daughter. So I have a recipe on my channel for avocado mousse if you'd like to check it out. I also just made some aquafaba whipped cream. Uh, just very easily, I just took some aquafaba, whipped it up, added some sugar, and I'm adding some strawberries onto mine. This is going to be my dessert. My daughter is going to have hers as well, but in a few minutes. What's on my hand? That is the tart liner. I was at Sephora with my daughter, and she tested it on my hand. Anyway, there is my dessert. And I ended my day with a cup of Jamaican ginger mint tea. So guys, that's what I ate today. Sometimes I eat more. Sometimes you don't feel like eating more. And today was a day where I didn't feel like eating a particular lot of food. So thanks for watching. Hit me up with any comments, and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, 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 oh,